Uh, this is part two of looking at an ANCOVA involving end of year stress for uh, medical, podiatry and dental students using start of year stress as a covariate. Now we've done the analysis but we didn't examine the correlation between the covariate and the dependent variable which we should know about before we do the analysis and the reason for that is that there's not much point in putting in a covariate if it's not significantly correlated with the dependent dependent variable it will not um, have much impact on the analysis so here is the overall correlation between stress at the start of the year and stress at the end of the year 0.53 so it's clearly correlated let's get a scatter plot but in doing this um, end of year stress on the y-axis, start of year stress on the x-axis. Let's also include set markers by university course because what I'm getting to here is that the, the assumption for ANCOVA that's additional is homogeneity of regression slopes and that is that the correlation between the covariate and the dependent variable is similar for each level of between subject variable that, y that we have. So we'll run that um, scatter plot, double click on the graph, and then you can choose this little icon, add, add fit line at subgroups. We can also add the overall fit line, make sure it's linear, and we can examine what's going on here. So there's our overall line of best fit which it, we know is a correlation of 0.53. We have two groups here with slightly lower correlations and another group here, uh, medicine, perhaps, perhaps with the lowest correlation actually. Um, 0.03. Yeah, we can see there that dentistry and podiatry have stronger correlations. Medicine has the worst correlation. Now we can get that statistically if we split a f uh, the file between the between groups variable and then rerun our regression command and we'll get three different correlations. So for medicine, actually the correlation's only 0.18 for dentistry 0.48 and for podiatry 0.54 and overall it was about 0.53 so they're all positively correlated but medicine the medical students don't have as strong a correlation between start and end of year stress so that's probably okay for an ANCOVA although ideally um, this would be closer to the other ones if in doubt, we could run a separate one-way ANOVA for just this group, this group, and the other group, and see whether or not there's different results between the three groups.